This tutorial video will demonstrate how to use the grouping feature in the Ensign program. When you open up a chart or a series of charts, found in the bottom right corner of each chart are two boxes. These two boxes enable you to group charts by symbol or by time frame. To begin, we will demonstrate the feature of grouping by symbol. The left box in the bottom right hand corner of each chart is the grouping by symbol tool. The purpose of the grouping feature in general is to allow you to make a change on a certain chart and for that change to take place on each of the charts in that group. The boxes allow you to color coordinate your groups. So to demonstrate the grouping by symbol we will click on the left box in the bottom right corner of this chart. Before we click you will notice that each of these charts are the same symbol but different time frames. When we change the symbol on one of these charts, the symbol will be changed on each of these charts, but the time frame will remain the same. To group charts together by symbol, click the left box. A color palette will appear. Select the color that you want to have for that group. We will choose yellow. Then select OK. You must do this with each of the charts that you want to have in that group and be sure to select the same color. The charts are now grouped together by symbol. Each of the charts with a yellow left box are contained in the same group. To demonstrate the grouping feature by symbol, we will change the symbol on this IBM 2 minute chart to a different symbol. To change the symbol, on your keyboard, select Control S. A new symbol enter box will appear. Here, enter a new symbol, and then press Enter. You will notice that each of the charts will then change to the new symbol entered. But notice that each of the time frames on the chart stayed the same. You do not have to group all of the charts opened in the same group. For example, we will leave these two charts grouped together in the yellow group by symbol and change these to blue. When I enter a new symbol on this chart, only these two charts grouped together will change. The two yellow grouped together charts will stay as they previously were. The grouping by symbol feature allows you to make a change in symbol on a chart and for that change to take place on all the other charts in the same group. The same steps and procedures are true for that for the tool of grouping by time frame. The time frame grouping box is the box located in the bottom right corner on the right side. When you click on this box, a color palette will appear. Select a color in which you wish to group your charts together. The grouping by time frame tool allows you to make a change in a time frame on a single chart and for each of the other charts in that group to change as well to the same time frame. For example, each of our charts here are a different symbol. But since they are grouped together in the time frame group, we can select this chart and change its time frame. And each of the charts in that group will change to that specified time frame. But notice that each of the charts symbol stayed the same. The grouping feature in Ensign is an excellent way to help organize your charts. This concludes this training segment.